I know what the transference is, but what's the relationship between that and simple um, attraction to a man or to a woman? You work in depth with somebody, and the anima and the animus can sort of ensnare each other, and then you can start transferring different things on, onto each other, versus just thinking that guy would be good relationship potential, or just thinking that woman would be good relationship potential. Technically, they are, that, that is transference, because it, it's an artifact of that relationship which you're having, and it's, it's unusual. Uh, uh, it's not like any other, you see, because you have a degree of psychological intimacy with someone you don't have with anyone mm. if you don't have that in your relationship if you've got one of course you know um outside of parents or as i say an intimate relationship that it, it's it's of a similar kind but it's an artificial one because it's been brought together for a specific purpose and, and that's why it's supposed to be handled properly because uh, there's so many dangers there that you, know, you can really hurt people so does that presuppose, and I'm, this is not trying to get into secret wisdom, that you, through working on yourself, you can stop or prevent an attraction onto somebody else? Yeah, in short. I, I think you can, James. That's, that's, that's magic. Well, again, it, it, I think uh, uh, what Pauline probably means mm. um, is that when you do it, you'll know. Yes. You know, uh, because... Um, it's the only way that people will know is, is, is being involved in that way. Um, and there's so many versions of that that are possible. Um, because if it's unwanted attention you're getting, for example, it, it, mm. you'll feel completely different about yes, it. Yes, than if it's wanted. Yeah. Yeah, and it, 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 if it's wanted, then it's it's natural and it's just part of the flow of your life. Not necessarily. No, 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 I no, would say no. the opposite of that, actually. Yeah. I, I think if it's wanted, it, it suggests some work needs to be done. Okay, so so could you apply that to... So the the idea in my head is purely a theoretical thing. It's like I don't, I don't mean that as a value judgment either, James. You know, as in to say, you know, in a critical way, but just that if, if it's having an effect on you, then then you need to understand why. I don't mean you specifically, but any- oh oh oh, okay. I thought it meant by by okay. Yeah, there was a mis- misunderstanding on my end. I thought it was was a case of the the attention is coming towards you and you do like it, and then that could move on. Because I've heard about you know therapists and and their patients having relationships. Yeah, yeah. Well, they do. Some do. Some do. Yeah. Okay, but you know, say say if you like end up you know fancying someone in class or something, or at work or something like that, could could you figure out why you find them attractive? If it's if if it's not just on a pure instinctual basis, and then remove that, so basically yes, you, can. you should you be have able a duty. Du- yeah, you, you, you kind you, of have a duty you, to do it, to. really. Yeah. Yeah. So that's 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 magic. That's real magic to me. No, it's alchemy. It's, yeah. It's alchemy because the, the whole point of it is you're supposed to 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 fend that off. And it, it, yes, magic. Yeah, mm. uh, because there's a shamanistic element to it as well. Because people will come in and insist things and throw them oh, at yes. you. Oh yes. Um. You'll, you'll get it all the time. If, yeah. if, if, you, if you're working face-to-face with women, you're going to get it all the time. Yes, and, and I hate to say it, particularly you guys who obviously have good intellects, yeah. you'll get a lot of you it. You will, you will. You'll yeah. get far more of it than the average bloke, I would yeah. say. Yeah, Far more yeah. of yeah. it. Yeah. So any any woman who hasn't, you know, developed her thinking function or an, her animus su- sufficiently, um, you're likely to have some problems with. You've only got to be different to what they're, they're used to experiencing yes. or used to being attracted to. So, mm. you know, Matt Milburn, you know, the guy who plays the Bavarian von Hess, gets an awful lot of uh, attention from, from women. Some mm. of it quite vulgar, you mm. know, and he deals with it extremely well. He, does. he doesn't have a vein hair on his head at all. Uh, you know, he just isn't like that. You know, he's, he seems to be a decent guy, with proper boundaries, and there's no issue. He doesn't exploit anything like that. Um, if he was a therapist, of course, he would have that on top of anything else. Yes. But what that would mean is that the the kind of uh, attention he would get would probably be a repeat of the norm, because that would get in the way of anything else. And that's why I mentioned that woman earlier, because she couldn't understand what was constellated in her because no. it was outside her experience and mm. so many of these women will, will say things like you're not like my husband oh yeah or i've never met a man like you well that's absolutely yeah. true 
because if, if you have this knowledge and you're in this healing mm. role as well mm. you appear to be a magus and to have uh, the, the incredible wisdom that gives you immense responsibility because that yes. person will walk out the door and back into the context of their life and relationship yeah and you, you you've through her projection become a confounding factor in her life and in her partner or husband or a broader family's uh, life well i think particularly yeah. something like that because the yeah. strength of the transference and the projection is is, is going to be off the scale it, it, it will it? It, it will because it did not well, they essentially didn't... it's a soul image is being projected exactly. onto you and that's that's the point of the soul image just like we were saying like with freya earlier as an image mm -hmm. because it's close to the platonic form it's not um it's not obviously sexual at all Although people might say, oh, she's pretty or whatever. But they say, it's not that. And that's the point. Mm. Because if it was a pretty girl, well, there's a pretty girl, there's another one. Yeah. But if it's yes. like that, that is completely different. That persists. This, this, that's when you get this frozen image on the event horizon of the black hole phenomenon <laughs> happening. Uh, and, and that's just an image. And the image is important, obviously, for, in a platonic sense. But also, remember, Plato is about being rational and therefore the word and therefore the communication of the Logos, whatever that means. And if you have knowledge that, you know, the the practical living husband doesn't have... Oh, yeah. Fucking hell, upon yeah. my language, yeah. well, you it is, don't Steve. off get it. Yeah. Yeah, and they they weave yeah. incredible fantasies and around they, you, and and the the resistance to taking it back is by massive. them is massive. And then and then you have the woman scorn phenomenon mm. that they'll try and destroy you. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So oh they, yes. Oh yes, they do. Uh, yeah. And it might it could be just be simply that um, that they try and damage your reputation. Yeah. I mean, what better way of trying to do it, even if it's a, a, a pile of yeah. you know, yeah. some women will stoop that low. Oh, they will. They will. Because it, it's it's a it's a way of bringing a man down. It's to yes. destroy his reputation. Yeah. And then I suppose that's up to characters to of the character of said woman to not allow that to manifest. Yeah. Mm. But without consciousness, there's there's no resistance no, to it because it can't it, be opposed. It's outside of their awareness. Yes. And uh, so, when it so, when it powers up from nowhere, mm. that's when these things start to get called archetypes. Mm. You know, but really behind them is instincts, reproductive jealousy. Mm. It, it boiled down to that. Mm. 